Hello everyone, it's the full moon tonight and I'm hoping you're having a blessed esbat, enjoying the energy of the full moon. I was outside watching the full moon and it is amazing, so beautiful. I love the moon, love the energy. And now I'm back uh, inside and I just did a full moon spread. I don't remember where I found it, so somewhere on the internet. I don't remember where. And it's basically you put um, seven cards, you put seven cards and put it clockwise, uh, trying to recreate the moon. So I'm not, yeah, something like that. Anyways. And uh, I just want to show you the spread. The first card uh, shows uh, the relationship you have with the others. And uh, this uh, I used in this uh, for this spread. I used the Earth Magic Oracle. And the first card was Dream uh, Dream Time uh, Creation. So this tells me that uh, I have to be creative. I have to be myself. Don't be afraid to express myself. Uh, to others and uh, while being myself, the real me, mm -hmm. I'm gonna have, um, yeah, I'm gonna be, have nice relationships with others. The second card is a, deci a decision I have to, to make and uh, there's the Milky Way and it's uh, perspective. So if I have to make a decision and I have to make a decision uh, in my everyday life, I know I have. Um, I have to see all uh, all the perspectives and uh, you know think about it and know what uh, what would happen if I make this or that if I choose the plan plan A or plan B. It also tells me that um, don't be afraid to you know don't be afraid to look at something from another perspective. You may I may believe that this isn't good for me, but. Um, for example, um, if uh, career-wise, I am, I have to choose uh, between two jobs, and I think the first job is better than the second one. Try, try looking at it again, you know, from another perspective. The third card is how to uh, succeed in a goal you have, and uh, I chose Winter Solstice. Reflection, a really beautiful card. This tells me that I um, I have to, uh, you know, stop for a minute, take a deep breath, think about what I want, ref reflect, see what I have uh, done so far, what I've been through, think about myself, and look deep inside and know what I really want. That's how I'm gonna make the right choice and, uh, you know, reach my goal. The fourth card is how to create, and I chose Childhood. Childhood came out, in a sense, which is a really beautiful card. Um, and, yeah, it shows, Childhood shows, uh, shows that, you know, you know uh, create with innocence. Be, express yourself, think like you used to think when you were little, and enjoy uh, everything you do, so you will have fun and create something beautiful. The help that I get from the universe, and it's the green man, synergy, it means that there are uh, people willing to help me, and nature herself and the world is on my side and uh, will help me. And I think that's really beautiful, and that has to do with uh, the previous card too, that you know, create something beautiful, thinking, you know, innocent, and uh, the nature will help you and guide you. The sixth card is um, how to develop yourself and your gifts. And uh, the lotus flower came out, unfoldment. This tells me that I don't have to be afraid, that I have to unfold myself, you know, in order to to reach what I'm able to be, to do the most of myself. I have to
to unfold like a lotus flower. Don't be afraid to express myself. Don't be afraid to show my gifts, my abilities, and uh, all that I believe. And the last card is the gift the full moon gives me, the blessing. And it's the eagle, communion, which uh, means that um, I'm communicating with nature. Nature will guide me. And apart from that, also, uh, I will have the chance to meet people who will help me and uh, feel loved and uh, blessed to be surrounded by uh, nature and people who love me and uh, will help me. So yeah, that's the spread, seven card spread. I'm uh, I will write uh, the positions uh, of uh, each, um, the meanings of each position uh, below. And uh, yeah, it's a really beautiful spread. I'm doing it uh, every on every full moon. It's through and it's you know like my Esper ritual. It guides me. It I really have good readings with it, and um, I really like this reading with the Earth Magic Oracle, and uh, it's very accurate, and um, yeah, it gives me a lot of perspective and a lot of a lot, of, you know, makes me think a lot of about a lot of uh, things that I have on my mind. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, have a great Esper. Let's be.